With hurricanes like Elsa, your location does matter when it comes to what kind of effects you'll see from the storm and what kind of damage you can expect. You may hear us say something about the right side of the storm being more dangerous. Some are even calling it the dirty side of the storm. So what is it and why is it different? Let's take a look. The dirty side of a storm refers to an area of a hurricane or tropical system where you'll find the highest winds, highest storm surge and greatest tornado threat. So what side of the storm is that? Well, generally it's the northeast side of the storm or more simply put the right side of the storm. But it also depends on which direction the storm is moving. If it's traveling in the northern direction, the dirty side will be more on the direct right hand or eastern side. If the storm is traveling in a more western direction, the dirty side will be more on top of it or the northern side. So what makes it so dirty? It's all about the wind direction and a little math. For example, if a storm is moving north at 30 miles per hour and has wind speeds of 100 miles per hour, then the storm will produce winds of 130 miles per hour on the right, dirty side. While on the left side, winds move in the opposite direction of the storm's movement, so they'll be slower at 70 miles per hour. However, it's important to remember, as a storm grows stronger, every side becomes dangerous.